Uh, Assalamualaikum and very good morning to my dear and my fellow friends. So today our group are going to present our product which is Kasavnya. So um, our company's name is By TV and uh, our company is located at Penang which is the Bukhila Josh Town. And uh, the type of business of our company is ownership which is between me, Sarah, Shazana and Ilya. And um, you can contact us through Instagram, Facebook and also website. So moving on to the information of our company, as you know, Tasafya is actually a Chinese way, a traditional Chinese way. And in Penang, if you go to Penang, you can find um, Tasafya easily, but not most, tas not all Tasafya, Tasafyas are halal. So basically, Muslims like us hesitate to eat whether the Tasafya is halal or not. So we can't um, deny the fact that basically although Chinese uh, make the, the Tau Safia and although the ingredients are all um, vegetables uh, for vegetables people ingredient, we always hesitate because they are Chinese after all. So not being racist but it is the fact of people nowadays. So secondly, our company by TV is a company marketing Tau Safia. We are marketing Tau Safia. So we are not the people who make some Tausapia. We just market Tausapia. And the Tausapia are made by the locals, the local, the Muslim locals in Penang. So basically, when Muslim locals in Penang make the Tausapia, they don't have that medium to promote their own Tausapia to a higher level. So that's where we come and promote for them. So this is the objective of our company to promote the Tau Sapia made by locals and to make sure that the Tau Sapia is well known all over the country and inshallah worldwide. Okay, moving on next to the characteristics of our product of, Tasa, of the Tau Sapia. Firstly, it is a halal product. Halal product means that not only made by Muslims but also we purchase, they, the locals purchase their ingredient, ingredients from Muslims, okay. So it is like it is halal made by halal um, people that we know Muslims, and also the ingredients are also halal. It's like double halal, so you can assure that it is confirmed halal. Okay. Secondly, is the packaging. The packaging, as you know, Tau Safia. Basically, um, the locals they uh, they make it, they make they make the Tau Safia in. In, in, an, in an enormous um, amount of Tau Safia. So we take the initiative to package the Tau Safia into two Tau Safia per package, uh, per pack, and there's two Tau Safia per pack, four Tau Safia per pack, six Tau Safias, and also 12 Tau Safias. Because as you know, maybe we want to eat Tau Safia, but not all six. So we can always buy the two packet Tau Safia if you want to eat like for tea time or during work or for breakfast, you can always eat any any time. And also for the price, as you know, we pack like we have many types of uh, we have lots of packaging for the Tau Sapia, so the price will be very. Okay, for example, for the two packet Tau Sapia, they are we sell it for one ringgit, one ringgit fifty cent. So it is quite cheap. Even the school children can buy it. They are afford they afford to buy the Tau Safia. And also if um, if people for festive seasons, during festive seasons that would like to buy Tau Safia, they can always purchase the 12 Tau Safias per packet with not that expensive price, but it is affordable for everyone because as you know, the ingredients are very simple and also we buy the ingredients from local people so the price will be lower. Next is a low calorie product. For people, especially women nowadays, teenagers who are under weight control can always eat Tau Sapia happily because the Tau Sapia is low calorie product. Why? Why the Tau Sapia is low calorie product? Because um, our beans that we use, the beans that we use are grain A beans and it is certified by Marie. So when it is a grain A beans, the nutritional um, the nutritional grade is 94% out of 100%. So it is a very low calorie product. 
healthy product and as you know, beans are protein, good for your skin, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so, moving on to environmental analysis. Thank you. 
just walking in, trying for something out. Um, 
this is like pasal satu ni tahu satu ni ah pasal apa is actually like a flour and they will like they will flatten it put the toppings and they will roll it so basically tahu apa is about rolling the flour yeah so um you put it on a baking tray you put you know you apply some egg and then you bake it and then you can roll them around just so delicious So uh, the conclusion is that we, the workers of ITV, we will strive to enter the international market and fight in the name of Islam. Mm -hmm. so, uh, and not only we will like gain profit on ourselves, but also we help the locals in Penang to establish their skills in making kasapia. Yeah, because so that people will. Uh, appreciate more on how people um, like some people work hard to make tasapia, so people like us who eat tasapia will appreciate tasapia. And it's good. Thank you. So Thank you. Okay, happy happy stop. Thank you for huh? okay. Any question? Yes. Um. Just now you guys mentioned about having the great A beans yes. for your product uh, as far as I know great A beans especially from our beans perspective. So how can you make sure that your profit is there? If you you say that you can sell your Tausapia for for affordable price or you can say for a cheap price. So how can you ensure that your profit is there? Because you use the great A beans but you sell it for a cheap price. Um, basically the beans are The locals grow the beans themselves. Yeah. So when the when you know like some um, felda in not only felda but anywhere, if you want to know if your um, vegetables or anything are very good or you want to know your the grade of your crops, um, crops you have to call the Maori people and be research in their lab. So with that, by doing that uh, process. You will know that it is a great AB, and also the price will not be that high because you grow it yourself and your own <coughs> home so like farm. The, the, we, we, we like the money is like reduced because you don't have to buy from people. Yes, grow, you grow them Oh, you guys grow it. I mean, you yeah. Yeah. Us, the locals. Yeah. Because we are actually yeah. promoting. We are promoting. We are the company that promote that market. The tasapia made by locals. The green bean is certified by Kuali, it's a great A bean. Can you speak in what you get if you say it's not cheap? It is because the Tausapia is very small, right? No, the Tausapia is not small, it's huge. Yeah, it is not small. Our Tausapia is quite huge, that's why you said we will satisfy the customer. Then if you want to know the normal size of Tausapia, you have to go to Penang. And if you want to eat the Tausapia, you have to at least have Four bites to finish the one tasapia. So it is big. No, you can't just put it the whole tasapia. You should be just very small. No, no. Yeah, but you know, there's also like if you go to like the petrol station at Jalan Sri Bomba, petrol nuts. They sell like this tasapia small is one hundred eighty cents. Yes, very small. Yeah, very small. And it's like it's good. Yeah, it tastes very plain. It tastes green bean, but it tastes like other things. I don't know what it tastes like. <laughs> it's like, it's like yeah. And like the tau you just put it in your mouth and then just disappear, you know? It's oh. that small. I was very big. <laughs> yeah. Okay, any more questions? Yes. Oh. Uh, you said that the main ingredient is B. Yeah. Uh, so how do you uh yeah. how do you there is a thing there. How, no no allergic people how oh. Well, we actually the main ingredient is bean, but we also have other flavors like chocolate, peanut butter, strawberry, chicken. Oh, there is chicken. We are you are processing that now. You are on the trial. Okay. What is tosa? Tosa is basically a cookie. It's a it's a crunchy cookie. It's not exactly a cookie, but it's kind of a cookie, which um, it is 
actually popular among Chinese, but because it is good, so it's kind of popular among, you know, because in Penang, we, it's, Penang is the food of heaven. So people share food, but because they are Mandarin. So, um, because it's made of Chinese, it is, yeah, so, um, <laughs> Chinese, <laughs> by Chinese, not made of Chinese, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so, Chinese, so um, the most thing is they don't it was like they don't really, they don't really have the confidence to eat it, you know. So that's why Muslims start to produce it, so that you know, if Muslims produce it, everyone can eat it without feeling no, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you ever seen uh, egg tarts? Not the egg tarts, like the one that we sell at the baker's corner each. The oh, Japanese um, egg tarts. But uh, have you eaten um, tart donuts during Raya? Yeah. It is yeah. like that without the nanas inside that. And, it's yeah. a green and also yes. the, the outer layer of the tart, it is not like tart, it is not biscuit where you have to <laughs> 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 It is like layers of flour, layer by yeah. layer yeah. by layer. Yeah. 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 Is it like a of this as well? Uh, that's... From Kao comes tart nanas and other other things. <laughs> Any more questions? Yeah, okay, so um, how do you guys actually promote the Pasrapia for people who don't live in Phoenix? I mean, Instagram, it, social website, Instagram, social website. Like, how people want to find out about you guys? Like, how people want to know yeah, that you guys Instagram. have a Facebook page? Okay, that's where we as the um the people in that company we will go, we will travel. For example, we will open a booth at Joe Cable TV Eagle. We will that's a weekend way. Yeah, yeah, that's what we do. This is one of our market uh, promoting plan, ever, uh, trying to advertise in this. Yeah. Promoting this house of you guys. Because it's it's very that good. You can always contact us. There's a contact number at the kind of the business guide. There's a good place to find us to Instagram, Facebook, and also Thank you. 